Youth runner here with Rancho Bernardo. Sophomore standout Riley Biddle uh, just wrapped up uh, the Division One uh, girls sophomore race. Uh, her performance looked like uh, she would have been ready for the sweepstakes uh, out here today at uh, Balboa Park at the 44th A6 Mount Carmel Invitational. 1857-9, gapping the entire field uh, by more than a minute. Uh, but obviously, I want to start with the excitement that you were just sharing with uh, with your girls that top five is, uh, as a team. Like just uh, how, uh, how special and meaningful is it to be able to, uh, to share it? You know, because this is one of these you know unique events that if you're not in the sweepstakes. Everybody's racing by grade. So how important is it like that you know, that your grade can stay connected and kind of grow together? Um, it's really important to me because like other people are going to graduate and it's just awesome to share super fun moments with the team and it's honestly in my opinion way more fun than just winning as an individual. It's way more fun sharing it with your team. How excited and encouraged have you been about their growth and, uh, and, and their improvement and them kind of you know learning you know what training and what strategy works well for them? It makes me so happy and excited because I just, it's just so fun to see like the improvement with everybody and it honestly just motivates me to work harder and improve more. And obviously, you know, from last year uh, to this year, I know it's only September 21st. I uh, can't wait to see how this is going to translate for you, you know, uh, come uh, November, you know, especially, you know, when you know that you have a, you know, a considerable lead, obviously, you know, you were you're seeking uh, counsel, you know, from you know, all the, you know, all the people in your support system over there. Like, you know, what what were you most proud of, just in terms of your ability to, you know, try to stay as focused and present and locked in as possible? Because essentially, it was you versus the best version of you. Yeah. Um. Well, I was really proud. Um. I'm used to it in workouts, just trying to sustain like race pace, like by myself. But this course is brutal. The hills are brutal, and I was really proud of myself, just being able to maintain like a good, solid pace and like maintain the gap throughout Most the definitely. race. Most definitely. Obviously, we know uh, that the hills are uh, are always going to keep you honest. But uh, I am very thankful. You know, not just for you, but all the athletes that have raced uh, thus far. The conditions are actually, you know. Pretty pleasant yeah. uh, for Balboa Park uh, this time of year. I mean, I've been you know I've been here at this you know same time of day where it's already you know well in the 80s and whatnot. Like I, I mean, were, were you really feeling like in the second and, uh, and third miles that it's like hey you know I mean yeah it's hard and obviously yeah you know yeah the, the hills are going to challenge me but the fact that like that you were able to to stay in in command and really still be like ambitious and aggressive because because the conditions were you know were somewhat favorable. Definitely because I am just used to trading in like 90 100 degree heat and having the, these conditions always you just got to take advantage of it and use it to the best of your ability because it is truly an advantage most definitely Riley last thing obviously like I said the, you know the name of the game is you being great on this course in, in November how much do you feel like you, you've learned about what works best for you and in terms of applying your training and applying your skill set because you have you know, uh, such a beautiful stride and such a long gait, like to, uh, to be able to apply that specifically to this course. How much do you feel like you've learned about what works best for Riley Biddle at Balboa Park? Um, I've learned a lot. Um, I've learned if I'm a hill person. I've learned definitely a lot about myself, how like well I maintain paces and just like definitely incorporating what I need to work on in training definitely reflects on this course because I make sure to reflect and see where I really struggled and where I was really, you know, dying. And I definitely make sure to incorporate that in my training so I can come out as strong as I can in November. Awesome. Uh, well, uh, well, there was uh, no uh, no passing away today, just passing everybody multiple times over. 1857-9 again uh, for Riley Biddle, Rancho Bernardo, sophomore standout, winner of the Division One girls uh, sophomore race at the 44th A6 Mount Carmel Invitational. Stay healthy. Congratulations. Thank you.